show you guys um, some of my tack coats. This is going to be my second tack coat. It's going to be real quick, so you'll see how light of a tack coat I spray and how quick it should be. It's real time. I'm going to just let it roll, so watch it or don't. Um, yep, here I go. All right, so I'm out of product. I'm out of product, I gotta fill it up. Um, one of the main things is uh, when I spray, I try to remain the same distance from the car, no matter where I am. So if I'm just going, I wanna stay the same exact, you know, let's say for tack coats, I'm shooting around maybe six inches from the surface of the car, maybe maybe eight, eight inches. When I spray, um, and I tighten this down a little bit so I'm not getting as much product. When I spray for real, which I might show later, I'm actually getting about four inches away from the surface for this gun and I'm opening this up and I'm laying it wet and pretty slow. And I'm just dragging that wet line all the way down the vehicle. And I just, I mean, I haven't had any problems. I love it. It sprays great. Um, I'm, I'm a proponent of kind of upgrading to a compressor setup. Even in your garage, this is my garage, but I've totally decked, I mean, I've, you know, it's got the ventilation, it's got pretty good ventilation. I can't, I mean, I usually, I wear a mask all the time, but um, I'm here by the intake, so the fresh air is coming in and it's going that way to ventilate out. But um, I'm a proponent of upgrading. If you're gonna spray with the DYC gun, fine, that's cool. Um, you can do it. Tack coats is just like, like about seven to ten clicks open. So if you close it all the way down, seven to ten clicks up, that's your tack coats. I usually do. Um, and then 
you know, just progressively open that, open that uh, crank up until you get it and start doing it wet. But uh, personally, you get way better finish in my opinion with this. Um, it's a little bit more professional. It's a little bit more. Uh, it's more fun. I mean, these are these are a lot cooler, a lot more fun, and it also allows you to get into the realm of the glosses, whichever gloss you choose. Um, I personally find True Gloss to be a little bit more uh, simpler process, um, pain free. So, anyway, I'm gonna refill, and I'll check back in in a little bit.